Now, a few minutes with Andy Rooney. You probably didn't know this, but I have a nervous habit of counting everything. I count small things. For example, I count stairs when I go up or come down them. Because I've been counting, I know that this is President Barack Obama's 104th day in office. Glad no one is reminding me how many days I've spent in this office. A lot of words like office have two meanings, of course. The actual office itself in the White House must be pretty much the way President Obama wants it by now, not the way Ford or Carter or Eisenhower or anybody else wanted it, even though it's the same place. President Obama uses the same desk that President Kennedy used. I made this desk myself from a great piece of walnut that I got off my property. This is something I made to keep my pencils in. It isn't much, but I like it because I made it. It's one of my small things. I bet every president has some small things on his desk that are his and his alone, too. You know, I mean something other than mistakes. The president's office in the White House was redesigned after they had a fire in 1929. Franklin D. Roosevelt had it done over in 1933. I wonder if the president wakes up in the morning these days and thinks about doing the White House over, or if he ever thinks about how many days he has left there in it. He has so many problems. He must often think to himself, geez, how much longer do I have to do this anyway? Pretty good being president, of course. He doesn't have to get his own breakfast, for instance. But being president is hard. Obama has chosen the cabinet that helps him, of course, and it's between 15 and 23 members, depending on who you count as a cabinet member. I was thinking maybe he should add one more cabinet member, a member who does nothing but save government money by cutting out things we don't need. He'd be called the Secretary of Savings, or SOS for short. 60 Minutes, by the way, is an expensive program, but it is not a government program. It's a program we need, or it's a program I need anyway.